Hey guys, Assalamu alaikum. Hopefully, you all guys are fine. Today, in this tutorial, I will show you how to use Slack reminders. If you work a lot with remote team members, then you are probably very familiar with Slack as an effective collaboration tool. But did you know that Slack also has a powerful built in task reminder system? Slack reminders are a great way to always remember things like your work tasks, personal appointments, or birthdays. Here, how it all works. So, in this tutorial, I will show you how to add a reminder in Slack. The current syntax to add a reminder in Slack is very simple. There are three parts to the command, and once you add it, Slack will remind either you or someone else with the reminder text you specified at the time that you are stated. So, Let's enjoy how to add a reminder in Slack. This is the basic interface page of Slack and this is my Slack workplace. So in the first video tutorial I have showed you how to open a Slack account and how to create a workplace. In my second tutorial I have also showed you how to create a channel in Slack. So this is the please help is the name of my slack channel so today in this video i am going to show you how to create a reminder in slack so to creating a reminder in slack is very simple and you can remind yourself you can remind someone else or you can remind also you can remind some channel so here i am going to show how to create a reminder so here is the just comment box the message box in this message box uh, at first you should Hmm. write down the backspace from your keyboard just put on this backspace option and just click remind -E remind after writing back backspace or backslash and remind then we'll find there is option from the slash command so here is the slash command option that is a slash remind then it show you at the rate someone that means if you want to tag your reminder then at first you should write down at the rate then someone's name or if you want to reminder some channel or remind some channel in this case at first you should put the hash and please put the name of that channel so if i want to remind someone then i have need to show i have need to write that is remind then i need to write at the rate then someone's name okay fine by this by doing this i can remind someone to this reminder okay fine if i want to remind some channel then what should i do then at first i should write slash remind then hash sorry then hash then the some channel name suppose the channel name is please help so if you remind this channel please help then at first you should write remind then slash hash then please help so in this case i am just in this session i am just going to remind myself so in this case i am just doing this that is remind me it shows that this reminder only remind myself so the command is slash remind me then double quotation uh, double quotation then just write down r e m i n d e r reminder then close this double quotation so here i have put the double quotation and i have just put the double quotation also and beside this double quotation uh, inside this double quotation i have just write down the reminder okay fine here is my reminder declaration is okay now i have to declare in which date the reminder will remind me so if i put that is the 05 that means may 23rd 2020 that means at 2020 23rd may it will remind me and which time that also you should clarify suppose this is 10 30 pm so that means at 10 30 pm 23rd may 2020 this will remind you so that's all for 
and now I am pressing the enter or send button. So after doing this you will show that there is a message from Slack bot. Here this Slack bot will show you I will remind you reminder at 10.30 pm today. That means today at 10.30 pm this Slack bot will remind you about your reminder. Okay fine. So here there is a two option you see that there is a delete option and view reminders option. So in by clicking this delete option you can easily delete your reminder that is very easy. If you think that this, this is not required for me today so I should delete this reminder it's not necessary for me then of course you can delete this reminder. And there is another option for you that is the view reminders by clicking on view reminders you will find there is some option then that is complete or delete or uh, that means you can complete show complete the your mm, reminder you can delete your reminder view completed reminders in which is reminders that you have already completed close list you can close your reminders and of course you can edit your reminder so there is option if you want to see the total reminder list in your slack bot then just write down backspace remind list by clicking remind list so there is then synthetic error so at first you should write remind list so if you click write down the remind list then you will find the total reminder in your slack bot here i have only one reminder that is reminder at 10 30 pm so it is showing just one reminder reminder at 10 30 pm today complete or delete view completed reminders close this so here you will see the all reminder list hopefully this video is very helpful for you you can remind yourself you can remind someone else even you can remind some channel so if this video is helpful then I am really happy uh, that's all for today please keep in touch with Toss IT Corner to see latest tips and tricks and video tutorials thank you all of you to join with Toss IT Corner